was born and raised in a small farm town about 40 miles uh, west of here called Fireball, California. Uh, it was really neat growing up on a farm, um, being raised, riding a tractor, moving pipe. So it was very interesting to hear uh, more so um, the marketing aspect of, of how our product that we grow, it is transferred from our farms to the end consumer and, and the routes that it takes all, all around the world. Julie Adams from the California Almond Board and talk about some of the struggles uh, overall as industry and, and performance as a state. Uh, we're the leading producer of almonds in the nation, 80% of the world's almonds as well. They've had to face trade regulations and, and different markets and how they've actually been able to excel during this whole China-US trade ordeal. Being an ag business major, I'm definitely going to stay in the ag sector. Uh, I, I plan on being in produce once I graduate. Fresno State has opened my eyes by the opportunities that they've provided and, and given me. I met a, a few different um, uh, lending corporations and it, it's really cool to see how diverse and how big the ag sector is and how uh, many people are involved. Networking is key and that's something that this conference provides. Uh, we were able to meet some industry leaders and, and different companies uh, that, around the valley. We had uh, over 100 students from um, different uh, majors here at Fresno State attend the conference and they could take what was said in, in stride and, and really utilize that for whatever career choice that they, they decide to go in. So I'm, I was looking forward to hearing about um, just how the industry in general is doing. There's been lots of talk about imports and exports with uh, the agricultural commodities and um, with the government and how they're dealing with the other countries and um, just the relationships that we're building and how those prices are affecting um, the U.S. In today's society, we do tailor to um, how the consumer wants to receive their products and the convenience of it and that comes with marketing and packaging. We're able to do that through imports and um, exports as well because the consumers want to be able to have those commodities all the time. Just um, to listen to the language that um, these people are using and their passion towards it, it it's helped me learn um, what I'm about to enter into and I do love the industry and I'm looking forward to being able to be as knowledgeable as them and continue to grow.